very large box that came on one wooden pallet today. What this box is, is electronics, Amazon customer returns. Weight of this thing, it's, uh, it's pretty heavy. I'd say it's probably pushing 40 pounds. So I have high hopes for it because of the weight of it. That could mean it could be full of a lot of music records or computer printer paper. Let's hope for the first one, okay? So anyway, the full manufacturer suggests retail price is $1,713. That's the full price if everything was new, but it's not. These are custom returns, which means there's gonna be some used, there's gonna be some damage, there will still be some brand new. So my liquidation cost was only $201. So that's probably by like what, 13% or so, I'm guessing. So my, my goal is to keep it at 10, so I was close. I missed it, but it was close enough, right? So this only had one box to it for the entire liquidation. So fingers crossed, this is gonna be a good one. Keep your fingers crossed for me. Okay, um, where's all the weight at? I don't really see the weight in there yet. So we'll let's see what happens. So first item, I start pulling stuff out. I, ooh, there's a PS, ooh, there's a really, okay, we got some video games at least, good sign. So most of these items I sell on multiple platforms. Most items I do sell locally now just because of, uh, it's easier, honestly. So first item, we've got Alltech Lansing, but I mean, you can sell this stuff on eBay. You can sell on Amazon, Macari, Facebook Marketplace, OfferUp, Craigslist, any place you can possibly make a few dollars, sell it, you know? sell it or if you do really well selling it locally do it that way just whatever works best for you and sometimes what works best for me right now won't work best in six months it business changes all the time you know so we have a charging cord the first iphone cord a fancy blue one a navy blue black one okay let me pull out something cool Nice, PS4 Mortal Kombat Premium Edition. Ooh, in a steel book too. Okay, let me open this up carefully, make sure there's no code showing. And there is a code showing, so don't show that yet. Here we go, here's the game disc for the PlayStation 4. Oh, it's immaculate. The PlayStation 4 Mortal, Mortal Kombat. Use the code below to access the game. Okay, so this item is a good item. And I actually do not have this game, but I honestly won't keep it. Some PS4 games I do keep for myself because, I mean, as a liquidator, a pallet flipper, certain items you get from pallets, you do want to keep yourself because it's something that you enjoy or you like or you just, you know, you just kind of want your big boy toys. But something like this, nah, I know. It's not really something that I need to keep, but... Brand new price for this is $89.99, 90 bucks. Used price, I'm just going by Amazon prices, used price is $71 used. So that's pretty good. Item right here, 70 bucks. As high as 70 bucks. Will I get 70 bucks for it? Maybe. I might get 60 bucks for it, you know? You just don't really know until you actually start selling stuff, but I mean, it should go between like 50 and 70 bucks, I bet. I'm gonna shoot for 70 though, of course, you know what I'm saying? Next we got Halo 4 for the Xbox 360. Older system. The inner case is, no, it's not broken, yeah, it is broken. So the game is there, disc one and disc two, both games are there. Halo 4, can be much more like 10 bucks, I bet, at, at, at this point, you know? It's, it's an older game now. Glass protector for your phone. Pet safe, lead collar, gentle leader. A pet safe, why is this electronics? That's just things that just make you scratch your head because you don't, you don't understand why this is in electronics for, but that's different. But yeah, a gentle lead collar, like five, 10 bucks on that, you know? Nothing like crazy expensive. Oh, here's the entire, a very fancy package of these are the micro USB cords, I think, correct? So you got a total of one, two, three, four, five micro USB cords. 
with really fancy packaging. Kind of overkill on that. Oh, what's this? Anne of Green Gables. Complete four part film collection. This this movie sounds familiar, like maybe I saw uh, saw it at some point. There's all the movies. Two discs, four discs, six discs, eight discs, so it has all eight discs are here. So it is a complete set of Anne of Green Gables. Is it DVD? I'm guessing it's DVD. I didn't see Blu-ray on yeah, it's it's DVD. So Anne of Green Gables. I'm gonna actually look this thing up really quick just to see. Because sometimes these box sets can actually have some decent value to them and it can surprise you. And I don't really I don't think I've ever seen this box set before. Wow! This thing sells new on Amazon for $97.99. It's a hundred dollar DVD set. Wow, that's expensive. And it's selling used for $92 on Amazon. Wow, this thing this must be like out of print or something for it to sell for that much money. But I'll be happy with 80 bucks for this. Yeah, <laughs> see what happens, you know. Let's see, well, what, what is this? Okay, this is a very, very large CD set. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15 CDs. Actually looks like somebody put tape over them all. I want to gently remove the tape, but Bill Bruford's Earthworks Complete. 15 CD set uh, item. I don't, okay, this is going to sound bad, but I don't know who Bill Bru Bruford is. I have no clue. I don't, there's something, I don't, I'm guessing this is some kind of musician or something. Here we go. Earthworks Complete Deluxe Box Set sells new for $109. Wow. I mean, but it is 15 CDs though, so it kind of makes sense. So it sells $110 bucks new. Looks like on Amazon it sells new for $99. My goodness, what is up with all these used prices being so expensive right now? But uh, if it sells new for $110, i will be happy. I mean, it is used CDs. So, like, I'll be happy with, like, like $60. Bucks. Uh, there's no way that that um, is selling on Amazon used for, like, $90. Bucks. There's no way. You can list it for 90 It doesn't mean it's actually going to sell for that price, though. That's the only thing, you know. But I'll, I'll be happy to get, like, 60 bucks out of that. Here's another nice item. Tape on the back of it. We've got Wilco Alpha Mike Foxtrot Rare Tracks 94 to 2014. It has a piece of tape holding it shut. I don't want to peel it off right now. I don't want to damage the actual case, though, because... It's actually a pretty nice, nice case. This actually looks familiar. I think I might have gotten this before in a palette. Good possibility. But sells new for 40 bucks. That's the new price on Amazon. And used. Nobody's selling it used, but if it's new for 40, at least 25 bucks used on that. So that's not too bad. Oh, that's a cool phone case. It won't fit my phone, though, I don't think. No, nah, it's for the iPhone uh, XS Max, but you've got, like, the Don't Tread On Me flag. That's actually a pretty cool phone case. It does not fit my phone, though. Ooh. Looks like... It looks to be brand new, but the inside, it has some deformities. Look like a factory flaw whenever it got made or something. It's different. But, yeah, I mean... Phone cases, I try to sell these for like five bucks locally is what I try to get, but some like this, you know, a little bit, but if your phone's in it, you, you won't be able to see it, but, you know, three or four bucks on that item. Oh, cool. This has been a really good box so far. What is that thing? Oh, my. 
Okay, let me put this thing back for just a second. Oh my, my wife is going to flip. I'll probably have to give this to her just because she loves this show. Here is the Downton Abbey, the complete collector's edition set of Downton Abbey. My wife loves this TV show. The first thing I ever watched of it was the movie that was just in theaters. This is the entire series. Okay, it's tape. Somebody put a piece of tape to hold it shut. Let's go ahead and let's cut that. It's not fatty, so it's just like clear tape. Hopefully they're they're all in here. My wife will freaking love this thing. Very, very nice box set. This is really nice. So you have Downton Abbey. Like, picture from the TV show. Okay, I'm not too sure the significance of this. You, oh, this is the like the the front door bell thing. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Oh, nice. Here's coasters. Still factory sealed coasters. That's a very good sign. This is actually a really neat little neat little thing, thing right here. So it actually, it's like in like a picture frame, you put it on, onto your desk and that's kind of cool. It's actually a really, really nice box set. And now let's see the discs. Come on. Ooh. Two discs, four discs, six discs, eight discs. They're there, they're there. They're all there. They're all there. Wow, it is a complete set. I mean, it is in immaculate condition. Looks like pretty much somebody watched it like one time and then they returned it or something. Let me look this thing up. I'm not gonna sell it because she's gonna want it. I guarantee it. And I'll be happy to give it to her. Certain things from these pallets, you, you gotta keep certain items. I looked for this on Amazon and I couldn't actually find this just with a quick phone search. Looking on eBay and it looked like it sells new for like between 100 to 150 bucks new. That's for new fire seal prices. This is used. So for some used prices on this, you've got 60, 60, 65, 50, 50. So looks like used. This is about 60 bucks, which is actually a little bit less. I thought it was actually, but it is DVDs, not Blu-rays. But actually a little bit less I thought it'd be worth, but this is a very, very nice box set. And uh, yeah, I'm actually excited to give it to my wife because she's going to freaking love this thing whenever she, she sees this. But uh, I'm just going to like, add value of, that, of like 60 bucks to that. Good item now. Okay, the item we did have was this. Before I saw that, picking out of the box. Microsoft Surface Arc Mouse. That's nice. It's a good item to get. Man, this has been a really... I mean, <laughs> technically it is a pallet, but this is, you know, just a single box. This thing's actually been really, really good. Arc Mouse sells on Amazon for 43 bucks. Used condition. It's probably still a good 30 bucks of it. Okay, we got a iPhone XR cell phone case. About five bucks on that. Car charger. BTS Worldwide. There's no like a music box set. I think it's missing like the slip cover though. I don't see the slip cover for it. But we got BTS. That's that Korean uh, pop band or whatever it's called. See, it's in really good shape. Then this is, I'm guessing, probably some kind of a CD or a booklet. Yeah, just pictures, song lyrics and stuff. Then underneath that, oh, this is going to be a big BTS poster. Then it's like you've got like some business looking cards of some of them. You have a bookmark. It's a nice little box set. 
Uh, that's how much this thing's worth. So on Amazon, it's new for 20 bucks. It's actually not, it's not very expensive, but 10 or used probably like, you know, half price, 10 bucks, I bet. Probably a good, good price on it. iPhone cord. We got some colored pencils and electronics. That makes sense. Oh, we have, oh, we have replacement ink. Off brand, kind of like third, third party, like refillable ink and you know, not much value to, to that we've got table topics family guy table topic questions to start great conversations not fighter seal just it's just been poly bagged okay so it's literally little note cards that have topics on them you can talk with your family about never seen anything like that before at least this palette, I'm getting a lot of really different stuff I've never seen before in a liquidation. So that's always kind of fun when that happens. 25 bucks new. And it's still it's still sealed. So but even 20 bucks on that item. Let's see. Phone case. Fleetwood Mac. Three C D set. Poly bagged. No case. We got Wii Mario Kart Wii. There's a good game. Game is in it. Check in condition. It's good. Condition's good. So a lot of these Mario games hold value, even older systems. They can hold decent value. This is like the old Wii. So the value might not be a very expensive, but it's Mario Kart. Used for 20 bucks on Amazon. So not bad. Let's see. Music CD. Rick Walkman music CD, another music CD, Xbox One game, we got Cars 3, there's the game, ooh that's all scratched up, bad, oh, yeah it's still there, I thought it was just dirty but it's pretty scratched up, so, Hopefully it works. If it is, probably like 10, 10 bucks, I bet or so. If it plays okay. Correction tape. That makes sense. Okay, so as we dig down, there are some records in here that was some of the weight. Oh, a quick charge. This actually, I think, fits fits my uh, my camera batteries. This gives me an extra portable charger. No way. I gotta try it out. Like the camera I'm using, the Panasonic GH5. Oh, this, this is. That's my old Sony camera. That's right. Disregard. <laughs> Disregard. That would fit my old Sony camera. I don't use anymore. So. Yeah. So, okay, I'll be selling it. I think these chargers, actually, these are not cheap either. Whenever I bought a replacement charger um, for my old my old camera, I think it was like 50 bucks for a new one. It, like it wasn't, it wasn't uh, value priced. Whenever I purchased it, this was a few, few years back though. And didn't even pull it up. Honestly, this is probably gonna be used probably about 30 bucks, I bet. Let me go this record keeps looking at me. It's on the corner of the box. We have still BMZY looks like. I have no clue who that is. Yeah, records I sell for $16 shipped in the US. There's another record. We've got status quo on the level. Look at the hair. Look at the clothes. Boom. Status quo. Twin Peaks Fire Walk With Me soundtrack. Okay. Three records right there. Oh, cool. Chromecast. 
I got one of these in my last palette too. It's in pretty decent shape. So I have to make sure it works and everything, but yeah, it's not bad. And of course, I'm trying to think how much did this actually sell for when I looked it up last week when I got one out. And I was thinking it was like 50 bucks, I think. If I remember correctly, I thought it was 50. But that could have been the, the, the new price, not the used price, so. Okay, it's new. It was. It's new for 70. So used, probably about 50 bucks. Actually, last week's I haven't sold yet. Um, actually, I haven't even tried to sell it yet. Oh, here's an Uber sign. That's the first time I got one of these in a liquidation palette. We have an Uber sign. Plug this into your cigarette lighter, and then you can work for Uber. Got a stack of CDs right here. Bewitched soundtrack. ACDC, we salute you. NFR, Lana Del Rey. Miles Davis, iPhone cord, okay. This box is full of stuff though. LED energy saving. Oh, it's just a thing of light bulbs. Okay. Let's see, Fallout 76 PC game. Don't know if it's been used or, or not though, but PC game. Installer Institute Training Series, Vehicle Security. Use DVD. A lot of those, you know, I just get a buck or two out of them, not, not very much. iPhone cord. Here is a like replacement power cord. A pretty standard one. Let's see, a wall charger with power delivery. iPhone cord. Oh, well, this is, uh, yeah, plug your HDMI into your TV set. Yummy, kind of like a knockoff, what's that thing called? Fitbit, like a knockoff Fitbit. Not much money on that. Ooh, so here's some, cool. You got Soul Calibur 6, Xbox One. Ah, it's taped shut game is oh the game that is in it is metal gear solid 5 ground zeros 2013 already so much older game in it but i mean you, you, you can still sell the game obviously probably 10 bucks or so then we got halo the master chief collection and it's in there it looks good Halo Master Chief. Oh, cool. It's The case is kind of damaged, though. Spider-Man Collection. I had one of these in much better condition. I sold for 10 bucks, And this case is kind of busted up on it, though. So that's probably be like a local sale for not, not very much, like 5 bucks or so. Because the case is pretty damaged. Alice Cooper CD. WoW 2018. Vintage Holodrag Stravaganza, the case is all smashed up. And we just danced too. This is a lot of stuff in this box. We're getting towards the bottom now. Getting getting closer slowly. Taking a while though, isn't it? We got some cheapy replacement headphones. Some Intax film. I want to see if this film has been used or not though. This uh, film sells really, really quickly. So one of them is still sealed. So I, I can still sell this one. The other one has been opened up. It's been compromised. And then we've got life proof case for an X, X, or X, iPhone XR. Couple DVDs. Let's see, what is this? Oh, we got deodorant, nice. Axe dry deodorant, four sticks of it. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep that. I actually have enough deodorant right now from Liquidation Palettes. I haven't bought deodorant now in like five years because I I get sticks all the time in palettes. You know. Oh, nice. I don't have this game. I'm gonna keep this one. We've got PS4 2K20. 
Is it in there? Yep. And it is awesome shape. So it's probably good like $40 right here, I bet. But like I was saying, you buy pouch, you'll get lots of toilet paper, deodorant, uh, stuff like that. Like you'll never buy that kind of items again for your personal like use because you'll get them and you'll get all this stuff in pallets. Uh, phone case. Oh, here's now one of these Anna Green Gable things. This is kind of expensive too. What was it like 60, 70 bucks? I think it was. So two of those in, in, in this box. Oh, nice. Dual Shock controller, PlayStation 4. I think I just sold one of these recently for like 15, 20 bucks on eBay. I think it was. I think, I think like, like right before Christmas time. Here's a CD. Oh, corn. The new corn CD. The nothing. We got a stylus Android Apple pen. The Dash 3. I actually might have some value to it. Let's look it up. Just, just, to, just to be safe. Because some of these stylus pens can have some value to them. Oh, yep. Yeah, 38 bucks new. So used at even 20 bucks. Okay. We got Alan Jackson CD, iPhone cord. Oh, what's Alienware? Nice. Just taped shut by Amazon. Cool. That's awesome. Never received this before in a palette. I have no clue how much an Alienware like specialty mouse would even cost. Found it. $31 new on Amazon. Used. 20 bucks, I bet. Probably a pretty, pretty fair price for it. We're getting close to the knit and gritty. We got like a... Looks like maybe like a MacBook Pro or an iPad... Or like a MacBook Air case. Okay. RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars. Then we got glass shield protector for your phone. The best R&B album, 100 hits. We have GPI case. What is this? Is this some kind of like a knockoff old old uh, Game Boy or something? No clue what this is. It looks like an old an old Game Boy. It has cartridges for it too. Really? Like it runs on batteries, it needs it needs batteries, but yeah, this is pretty much the old Game Boy. That's neat. Not sure it's really worth anything. But it's called a Retro Flag GPI case. I have I've never heard of this. Kind of like a knockoff Game Boy. Uh, I'll research that later. It can't be worth that much. Let's see. We've got five inspirational films, five in one movies. Probably a good five bucks on that item. We have a radar laser detector and, and telecord, a brand new in the package, factory sealed. Cool. Xbox One wireless controller. This has actually been a really good box. This has had a lot of really good stuff in this box. There it is. These I sell about 35 bucks. Okay. Reebok step workout. <laughs> We got a professional tool case, like little small gadgets, four foot cable. That's the iPhone. That that is a lightning cable. How did all this stuff fit in that box? This is a lot of stuff. Phone case. This is a envelope. Glass screen protector. Hamilton CD. The last two things. We've got glass screen protector, 
and some toothpaste for your dog. <laughs> Ended on doggy toothpaste. But yeah, that was a really, really good palette. I mean, one huge mystery box. I paid 201 bucks for all this stuff. That's crazy. This was a lot of stuff. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with this. Um, yeah, this is going to be very, very profitable once everything sells. Yeah, this is going to make quite a bit of money on this palette. I wouldn't be shocked if all this stuff sold for 800 bucks, maybe, maybe as high as a, maybe even upwards of a thousand dollars. But it's a lot of good stuff in in this palette. Very happy. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this. I enjoyed this. This was fun. I'm gonna keep four sticks of deodorant. And my wife, I'll give her the Downton Abbey entire collector's series set. So I I get deodorant, she gets DVDs. So we both get a little something from this palette too. So yeah, actually I'm going to keep the PS4 NBA 2K20. So I'm going to keep that. So anyway, still awesome. Very fun. Hopefully you enjoyed this. But yeah, this is my full-time job. I buy liquidations and I resell them. Anybody can do this. There's no limitations. Anybody that wants to do this can do it. You just got to just put forth the effort and just do it. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I'll see you again next week. Next week, I'm going to have a couple of special videos coming up with uh, some new types of items. So be on the lookout for that. I'll see you next time. I'm out.